I don't care if everyone plays Overwatch now, and I should have made this video like four to five years ago. I want to talk about it now. Okay, so you want to learn how to play Team Fortress 2. Step 1. Install Gmod and make the TF2 characters make silly faces until you determine which one is your favorite. If you can't pick your favorite with this method, then watch all of the Meet The videos on YouTube, and that should do it. Before you start playing, you'll want to make sure that people in the server know you're the real deal in this game, so you'll need a fantastic hat. This one is right up my alley, and it tells the other team, I mean business. Now pick a casual game and search for a party to join. The time before the match starts is used to say your prayers to Gavin for a win and that hopefully there aren't any good NGs on the other team. If you decide to pick Heavy or a Pyro, it's a good time to pocket a medic so they'll stay with you. Please. Please don't leave me. I need you. If you decide to go with the Scout class, I recommend you generally be as slippery as possible. The Atomizer, Scattergun, and Mad Milk are a favorite loadout of mine. Just jump in and out of battle and keep spraying the enemies with your D. Praise Marva! The Soldier is, in my opinion, the most well-rounded class. He's got an overall average speed and attack and amount of health- OH WAIT! HE CAN FLY! He can fly? No. Jump good. I like using the gunboat shoes, or the Uggs of the Soldier class, to reduce the falling damage from rocket jumps. Always make sure to try to shoot where the enemy is going and not where they are to land your hits. So, you've decided to go pyro, huh? Well that means you're a no good stinky noob, no stinky noobs allowed on the server! Ahem. I mean, the back burner is dope. I kind of like hugging the back in Man vs. Machine of like the cliff that they jump off of, because they always have their backs to me, and then it's like if a university had tons and tons of triggered SJWs, but instead of triggered SJWs, it's crits. It's crits for me. Heavy class. You play this game like a sandwich. You are the meat pushing through the opposition to capture points. The enemy team are the veggies that no weak heavy wants. You must kill the veggies. Your medic and the capture points are the warm bread of victory. I put this in a simple analogy because heavies are not the brightest. If you chose the medic, you either have bad aim or you're being a great mate and just helping out the rest of the team. A pro tip is to uber the spy. Speaking of the spy, the first and foremost thing you gotta know to play the spy is how to dance. Crab dance. This dance is what convinced Blue Scout's mother to fuck the Red Spy. It's more potent than posting a hentai picture in the map and stabbing whoever stops and stares at it. Fun fact, the Spy is a favorite class of Mr. Maynard James Keenan of Tool, APC, and Pussifer, I've noticed. Always be very terrified of the Pyro, and I recommend going Ghost and changing directions a lot so your enemy has a much harder time tracking where you went. P.S. Nothing feels better than going Spy and backstabbing a Heavy that keeps killing you with his pocket medic. Nothing. Oh, so you want to be elite sniper, huh? I use the bow and arrow, because it's easier to get a headshot since you're shooting projectiles and not bullets. However, the stock rifle is great too. Whenever you engage another sniper, it just becomes a giant pissing contest. And you better show them you pew pew better than them. Height advantage is also key for snipers, so get very high. Demo Man. We can learn how to play Demo Man with a great old Scottish proverb. Start with a bottle of scrumpy! The next thing to do is get into a map with tight hallways with the lock and load as your primary weapon and just, just ruin the enemy's day. Last to hit F4, but certainly never the least, God Emperor NG. Since God made the map, he knows where everything is. A great NG knows exactly which corners to put the sentry and rocket launcher. He knows where to bless the team with teleporters and health dispensers. And he knows where the scrap is to continue building his great works. One does not play NG. One becomes NG. NG is love. NG is life. Hey, thanks for watching my dumb video. If I made you laugh, then I got a bunch more of silly videos on my channel and even more on the way. And please don't forget to like and subscribe, it really helps me out. Bye bye